back out here at the uh, Family Jam Farms. I just talked with one of the owners and he's excited about the progress that they're starting to make. Uh, down at the trails, the general store is open. Uh, they got food and drink and ice and whatever you need, they got it here. You won't find that in a lot of places, and but they do have it here. You know, and they got a nice parking area. The people here are great. So, hey, you got a f some free time and an ATV? Head on down to Enterprise, Alabama here at uh, Bama Jam Farm. You'll find it. It's not hard to find. Check out all the progress that's being made. So come on, join us here in the great outdoors. I don't know if you can see behind me, but there's, uh, you can see the construction equipment over there. Uh, they're going in and putting the picnic areas in, or camping areas, so you can camp right there on the trail with your ATV. Uh, that's the first thing they're going to do, and uh, they've already started that. Uh, we're going to go check out and see how far along they've, uh, they've come with the project. But uh, I'm assured that there's going to be a lot of big improvements here. You know, just starting out, money is an issue. So, if you want a good ATV park here in uh, Coffee County in Enterprise, Alabama, you need to come out and support them. construction equipment and they're building campsites and they're picking out the prettiest spaces uh, usually most of them are right along the lake that's where I would have put them if it was my property uh, it's just gorgeous along that lake and it's good to see that they're holding up to the word and you know, they promised that they'd start making improvements and they're already doing it be no time in this place to be ready for uh, campsites right here along the, the trails.
peaceful here. I mean you could live here. It's nice and quiet. You see the birds, the lakes behind you. It's peaceful. You know if you've got a lot of stress or whatever, a stressful job or whatever, I'll tell you this is just the most relaxing place that I've come to in a long time. It's only one place I can think of that's probably more relaxing to me and that's church or somewhere where God is at and God is right here believe it or not he's right here and uh, I can feel his presence I can hear his songs and the birds and the uh, trees and things around there's nothing in the world more peaceful or more spiritual uh, than being out in the great outdoors but I was well prepared yesterday Gail and I stopped at the uh, Army surplus store. Now they're able to pick up MREs. <laughs> uh, MREs is meals ready to eat. Military uses them. Uh, they're great for out here. You don't have to worry about cooking or whatever. You have got uh, sloppy joes and four or five other ones. And uh, they're really great to have out here. Some pretty little flowers. This is a little tiny aster. Probably no bigger than a nickel. There's one over here. He's kind of on his last leg. There's a little yellow one. Well, we're going to finish up our break. We're going to head out and ride the yellow trail. Uh, try to get some video of that again. Uh, it's it's nice to really to see that the uh, trails are have been ridden. They kind of got you know the the wheel marks in them, and and it just makes me feel good that people are out here using these trails. And great ideas pop up all over the place, and uh, they're just not supported. You know, I know you guys that own your own property and so forth. You have a place to ride, and it's, and that's good. But sometimes you just need to get out and try some other places and get your friends together and you just go have a good time. I'm sure you can do that on your own property. Yeah, but it's people like me who don't have a, any property or, or are dependent on others to open up parks and, and so forth. And it's great having one here in, in Coffee County. The best ones that I found, you know, were up towards Birmingham. That's a long ride just to ride your ATV. And this, I think, I feel in my heart that this place was put together for the right reasons. And God will play a part in this. And uh, these trails will be great family trails and great get-togethers for families and friends and it'll just be a, a, a good thing so we need your support come out and, and ride you know and come and meet the, the people you know if you're interested in, in a club uh, I'm a member of the Chiha Trail Riders Association which is a club out of uh, North Alabama and they have great discounts and and so forth and it's a great club to belong to and we're trying to get a chapter started down here you know, and with the right support, we could do it. This would be a great home base for uh, Chiha Trail Riders uh, Chapter Coffee County or something. So, you know, check it out. And if that's something you would be interested in, you can call me or look for Lynn McMillan. I'll give you his phone number at the end of the video. You can call him and he can get you signed up. And we can get our own chapter here. You know, and we can compete against them, or whatever, and just have a great uh, fraternal organization.
This is a neat little armband that they give you when uh, you come in to ride. You know, one of the best things about this, riding at Bama Jam Farms, you're tired after a day of riding and shooting video. I'm only 15 minutes from the house. 15 minutes and I'll be home. But I want to thank you for joining us. We'll see you again the next time here in the great outdoors.